Hello, it's Sean, and welcome to Hero of the Table. Today I'm going to be painting some skeletal cavalry. These are Decians from Battle Valor Games. These are Decian cavalry with spears and shields. The models have a couple of different styles of shield, um, and then they all have spears. There's also command models for the unit, so you've got a, a standard, um, an armored leader and a musician. Um, I've already cleaned these up and sprayed them with a uh, just a tan spray paint. It's a flat camo color that I get at Walmart. I've sprayed these all. It's going to be a real simple paint job on these. I'm going to wash them with a variety of colors and then pick out some details and put them on bases. What I'm going to do is I'm going to wash with three different colors. Seraphim Sepia, Soft Tone, and strong tone and that's going to give a little bit of variation to the colors of the models in the unit I've finished washing these with a couple different colors so you can see the variation. Um, I failed to record sh painting the shields and spears. Uh, I just painted them with uh, oak brown and give them a nice solid wood color. The shields, the round ones with the uh, metal edging, I just painted the center and the backs and I will paint the, the edging and the shield boss and the spear tip with silver later. Next up, I'm going to paint the reins and kind of the saddle bit there with leather brown. Next, I'm going to paint the saddle cloth just underneath here. I'm going to paint that with red. It's going to give a little bit of color to the model and help it just have some some contrast on the table. Next, I'm going to paint the metal rim on the shields and the spear tip with Vallejo Metal Color Steel. Next up, I'm going to wash the saddles and the saddle blanket and reins with Agrax Earthshade. Next, I'm going to paint the base with Burnt Umber. I've got some metal bases. These are 40 millimeter by 30 millimeter. I've spray painted one side with a brown color just to, in case any of it pokes through later. It uh, looks like dirt. Uh, what I'm going to do is glue these onto the bases, put three of them on a base. I'm mixing the colors so that they uh, kind of have some variation on the base. So each of the three colors that I used on the original models will have one of each of those on the base. Next up, I'm going to texture the bases. You can see the uh, the base of the model kind of it fits a little bit higher. I'm going to add some filler in here to kind of level it off. I have this mix. This is drywall putty, um, brown paint, and some wood glue. I think the wood glue helps to keep it from chipping, and then the brown paint keeps it so if it, it if it ever does chip, then it's not a white uh, a white color 
showing it's uh, brown so it's kind of hides what it is a little bit so I'm just gonna fit that in here try not to get any on the models as I'm doing it and just kind of level off the base Next up, I need to flock the bases on these models. I've got some watered down wood glue, a couple different colors of flock. And what I'm gonna do is spread the wood glue around, sprinkle on a little bit of dark, a little bit of light, and then cover the rest of the base with the uh, middle green. I've finished painting this group of Decian Cavalry from Battle Valor Games. Uh, these are undead skeletal cav. A fairly simple paint job, but I think they look pretty decent. Um, I'll be happy to use them on the table. Uh, I've gone with a couple different colors for the base color. Um, I guess I sprayed them all tan, as you saw, and then used a couple different washes to give some variation. I don't know if you can see it great on the video here, but there is some variation of color from each of the models here. I uh, did a little bit of colors just to kind of bring out some contrast in the model because otherwise they're pretty pretty just much bone. I like these models. I really like the stuff that Battle Valor Games puts out. I've, I've painted up a few models. I've got a lot that needs to be painted but I like the way it looks. I like the sculpts. I like the variety of models that are available. So did a little command section. Didn't get this on video necessarily but the uh, the flag is just a 3x5 note card that's cut down. I painted stripes on it with black and uh, bone color and then I, I did a light gray on the black areas and then I washed the uh, bone colored stripes with uh, a little bit of Agrax Earthshade and a little bit of Seraphim Sepia from Games Workshop and I kind of kind of like the look of that. Simple paint job but again I think it looks nice on a table. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos like this and the other projects that I work on, you can subscribe to my channel. Be sure to click the bell so you get notifications when I post new videos. You can also follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook, and there I post about games I'm playing and projects that I'm working on. Some make it to video, some don't, but just kind of what's happening with my hobby. There's links to all of those in the video description. If you have any questions or comments, please put it in the comment section. Remember, you don't need to be an expert to paint your models. Even a basic paint job will make for a better game. Thanks for watching.